going to check them if uh, there's any mites drop. Pulled it out already. I don't see any mites in this one. Last year I found one mite inside the drone brood and I applied formic acid right away. Same dosage what I'm using <coughs> this time. I got a few dropped after that. I'm sorry, my voice is really bad. I have been sick in the last since the last three three days and I was not good. Still trying to recover. Oh uh, no! Uh, uh, we'll, ch we'll check on the other one. Sometimes the best place to check for mites after you treat, if you still have this, if there is mites, drop sometimes it just and get stuck underneath here in the entrance reducer here are the varroa mites I've seen first hive I've seen varroa mites I've checked most of them here this only hive have varroa mites yet found nine nine mites in here and then now I am I am curious if uh, the brood in this one is infested or not we always check but you know we can miss it easily also so I'm going to check if I can see more drone cells in here I try to uncap if it's already inside the drone drone brood or not I'm just curious Capping fork with me, so I just need to use my hive tool. The drone don't have mites in them. I don't know if you can see my hands here. Where is it? Okay, here I am too far. See? No.
No, I don't see any mites inside the drones. Drone are broad. Try to uncap a few more. Larva really healthy looking, it's uniform and lots of real jelly. We don't see mites inside the drone brood as the first target of varroa mites, but as I said, I can't get complacent, so I just decided to treat them all as uh, usual. We do this every you know, at this time of the year, every year. And then, uh, it, that means it, this is Varroma just started in this area yet, just you no, know, it didn't. It's not inside the, the, the brood yet. So, if I wasn't treating anything because I don't see anything in the brood, uh, thrown brood, and then I'll be in trouble in the next, in the next month or during honey flow. It's gonna be too late. So, I think it's a good thing that. Uh, we just continue here treating them because I also don't really uh, besides on that uh, checking from the brood like opening them if there's mites or not the other way of monitoring them is catching 300 nurse bees and alcohol wash them and just spread them on the paper towel and just check if there's raw mites or not but for like for this one I only found nine on a double brood box colony and what's the chance of catching one of those mites on on those uh, you know from those 300 uh, nurse bees so the accuracy is uh, very hard to you know to get that uh, at this stage for the ear earlier stage you know of raw mites infestation but if it's infested already heavy then it's pretty easy to to see mites from the 300 there's bees so that's my insight on testing for raw mites